everybody. Today we're going to have another Dollar Tree meal. And um, I think I'm going to call it Riblet Surprise. But anyway, I'll show you what we're going to do. And um, anyway, I'll put you down. Here's the wax paper. And we're going to take a can of the jumbo biscuits that came from the Dollar Tree. There's five in here. And we'll open it up. It says cook these on 375, 11 to 15 minutes. <laughs> and if I can get them open, Okay, there might be a problem here. Maybe I do this. There you go. I got them open, so. Just take these out of the package and take one. And this is the roller thing I'm using. And roll it out. You don't have to roll it real thin. Just roll it out maybe twice as big as what it is normally. And then, what we're going to do is I'm going to use these boneless pork riblets. If you've watched some of my videos from a while back, I've done a video or two with these, and I really love them. And I went ahead and cooked them. They could have cooked in the biscuit, but I wanted to go ahead and cook them in the microwave. You just open the end, and you cook them for... Um, two minutes but I'm gonna take one and put it in there in the center and I have five biscuits and one two three four five six seven riblets so I'm gonna take half of another one and put it there I'm gonna take a this has some barbecue sauce on it but I want a little more and this is um, Dollar Tree barbecue sauce. So I'm going to put a little barbecue sauce, not a whole lot, but just a few drops. And then, you know, Dollar Tree has cheese, which I do not care for, but you can get cheese from there and put on it. I'm going to use some different cheese. But um, put a little mound of cheese. And then I'm going to wrap it up as best as I can. Not too bad. Into a little bundle, a little ball. And then I'm going to take my, it's a silicone um cupcake thing and i'm gonna stick the ball right in there and i'm cooking it in that just so the bundle won't open up as easily so when i get all five of these made i'm gonna stick them in the oven and let them bake we're also gonna have tater tots from the dollar tree which they're already in the oven they take a little longer to cook so i went ahead and put them in the oven and when uh, I stick these in the oven and they're done we'll come back and give it a try we're back and our uh, riblet surprise has finished cooking and here it is they browned up beautifully I think so I'm gonna go on down to the plate I have some of the tater tots from Dollar Tree on the plate 
and I'm going to take one of these and I'm going to cut it open for you and let you see inside. And here's what it looks like inside. And then I'm going to give it a taste. And I'm just cutting a bite off. I'm not going to take a whole lot because today I don't feel so good and I don't really feel like eating a whole lot. So, uh, but I do want to taste it for you. think that is really good I like that extra barbecue sauce on it I love cheese on anything the bread is tender um, it's just good I think you could add other things like chipped up onion garlic salt green pepper uh, whatever you think you know to make it the way you like it but it is good and I hope you get a chance to try it, and I hope you love it. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.